So we're prepping for yard work here. Mike was pulling my trailer and I can get the tundra and pull the boat out of the RV pad here. That way we can start doing cement in the back here. And we're gonna move the boat to the other side of the house. All right, we are at low and the price of wood has gone up like crazy. Just a piece of wood here for like $19. You gotta be super straight here for the edge of the concrete. All right, we are low, getting ready to go home. Okay, here come the sunrise. Got the wood here, we're ready to do. And then we're gonna start digging. So I got the blue stake, people to come and mark where the gas line is. Uh, that way we're not gonna dig the trench around there. I move my boat here to this side. And eventually I'm debating to move this tree here or not. Cause I do not want I do not want to hit that fire hydrant and the boat park back there. Then we got the uh, we moved the trailer up the RV up last night a little bit and uh, now this long driveway we will extend it to the back. We'll do ten by ten at a time. We're gonna go get a pull away cart and. So this section right here today and we'll prep here um, all these will be cement here and I want to put a shed right here so we can also do cement down here too we can try to do that today if we can and the rest we're gonna do grass all around here to half over there I like my fruit trees Coming up. And I'm debating to get the Costco pavilion put right here, the canopy. And so I'm thinking the sprinkler gonna be all right here. This is all grass in the middle. Eventually we'll put a pool here, but uh, that's another project. And here's my pond, swimming pool pond. Bopa planted all these right here. Not bad, and here mostly we're gonna do cement, but we're gonna have a driveway coming that pull the boat back here, and I can do all about maybe 40 or 60 foot of cement coming from over there, and this will be pavers, flagstone, and so she's marking where the gas line is here right now. Just let you know they do it for free. Those you just call. 811 they come and do that so michael and i gonna be start to work on this yard we're gonna convert mars into planet earth i know some of you commented on our youtube here the first time we put a gardening in that um this place looked like mars yes it does but not much longer it'll be all green so we'll see how far we can do today here. But we'll start with the cement first. And then we will uh, start. I can go rent a trencher to uh, dig uh, the pipe for the um, sprinkler system. So we're going to unload the 2x4, 2x10, and 2x14. And we're going to outline here. This is a project for this morning here. I already dig this here. It took me like couple months just to tell you I've, I've been so busy lately playing around and uh, definitely want to extend this driveway all the way over here that's my goal so we have to we can do a section at a time 10 by 10 10 by 10 here 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 there there as you can see lots of project for me but we will do it we'll take it step by step So, oh, is she done? She's almost done. Okay, so we got marking. Pretty interesting. She got the flag up. So put the flag up here where the gas lines are. Okay, appreciate her doing that for us. Now we know where the gas lines are. Here's another one right here.
All right. Hey guys, we're excited for a new project here today. We're gonna do cement, 10 by 10, extending my driveway. Well, you wanna flat everything out as much as possible. And then you tie the string. And we do have a level kit to the make sure it's all even and then we'll put another straight wood from there to there to make sure it's all even out four by ten. okay first thing we do is lay the two by four by ten and now we're going to screw it together well the screws right. will make it so that the concrete won't push the now we to get this long driveway even farther out here There's Bob Pop and my nephew watering the lawn. Do this from that angle. Attach this to it. So each board there, we're gonna do two of these. That's gonna make it so the, the concrete doesn't push the board out and make it bow because concrete is quite heavy. So this big project ahead of us, we'll take you guys step by step on showing us how we do things here in our backyard. Like I mentioned before, our front yard is done. Back here is planet Mars, and we can convert to planet Earth here within a couple months. So welcome to Mars. Temporary, it'll be planet Earth soon. So it's do it yourself. We did it, we're doing it, and you guys can do it too. We cook, we eat, we travel, we play. Follow us on YouTube. And make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, Auckland. We are here at Rolling Rock Concrete. We're gonna get some cement concrete. Picking this up at Rolling Rock Concrete. With that, we are getting this ready. So cement was coming from here. There I go, guys. Shooting that, just like diarrhea. Ooh. All right. Rolling concrete. That's how we do it, guys. Here comes the cement. That's Michael backing up. Bring it right, up. Here we go. Whew. All right. Here comes the first pour. Hey guys, so we rented this part away cement. It's like two hundred dollars or so, two hundred thirty bucks, and we do ten by ten. So it's pretty cool. It's a very first pour. So while both is cooking, we're out here doing yard work, DIY, we cement, and bring the system. So stay tuned. Okay, so we've been using this 2x14 actually. And I've got some access over, put it in the wheelbarrow, and I'm uh, gonna put in that quarter over there. And that's coming along. Now I'm gonna smooth it out. Was just smoothing that out right now. Here, we want to make it soft and gentle. They want to soak like that. When you go that way, you want to tilt it a little bit there to do it softly. Woo! Pretty smooth, huh? Yeah. Fluffo was in the wheelbarrow. We're gonna put it right in that corner over there where my shed gonna go right in that corner. 
Looking good, huh? It's a little bit harder than what I thought, but we did it. We did 8 by 10 and I got to do 10 more of these in my backyard uh, in order to uh, push the driveway all the way to the back. Stay tuned! So look, it's been about an hour and a half or so, and uh, we can use a broom and uh, slide across. This is just for the texture. That way, when it's wet, it's not as slippery. Good morning. We're just moving the RV to this side. Move the Lexus out. The other tundra right here, but then we'll that way we leave the garage empty, and we're gonna move the RV to this side of the house. That way, when we we're gonna load two more for the cement. Okay, so we're here again, Saturday morning, loading a second load, and uh, we will do, need to do a third load here afterward. So, big project coming up. Cool, huh? Day two. We go more cement. We move the RV the side of the house, and we can take all the way back there. See this. So here he comes. Well, good morning. Here comes the sun. So we're just trying to back this up this corner. Pretty tight spot. That's our project this morning. Plus all this trenches for the sprinkler. So again, so we strain here. We got about two and a half yard of concrete here, so we have to get another half load of that. But uh, we're gonna put this stake on each side here, just to support the wood, the two by fours. sections and the rest of grass on the other side so it'll be a big project here this summer all right heavy all right we'll load down the wheelbarrow and pour it here we just add a little bit more water in there Alright, look at that. He is smoothing that out with the board. And you notice my side thing there. Well, guys, so while both of my brown laws back there uh, finish up the cement, I am pulling this here to go and get more. If we go on the freeway soon, all by myself, Bopas out at home cooking. Both my brother in laws are smoothing out the cement while I go get another load here. I'm by myself reloading here. Did a good job backing up. Got that done there. A second load. All right. We can do the rest of this here right now. Alright, 
spraying water in here when it's done. Okay. Oh, make a pearl my neighbor here doing his yard across the street and we are done loading this for today look at that such a busy we put all the cars out here I might just pull that out goodbye woohoo hello my sister's visiting because uh my brown house happened out too all right so looks like it's dry not too bad. A project for today. Check the cement out. So we still have some big project ahead. We have to do another 10 by 10 back here. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, maybe nine more. And I can fill this whole place with cement. All right, so this is the result. I'm gonna remove the two by four here. And we're not done yet. We're still gonna have more here to do.